I don't know how the light is for you on this, um, but it looks a bit dark to me. I'm just going to pull my blind up, but I think that's probably more to do with the angle I've got my viewer thing at. So I'll just pull this blind up, that might help a little bit. Um, the reason for this video isn't because of what, what's on here. This is to do with that new class I mentioned yesterday, and I don't want to say too much about it. But it's on my ironing board, and I find it easier sometimes to work on my ironing board, because the height is right is better so this is just some cloth i'm putting together as a base for something the reason i'm doing this video is to show you this in detail because last night i made an edge round here there and there and i just absolutely love it i can't tell you i adore it i'm so happy that i you know decided to do this like a pico edge that i stitched by hand and i thought you wouldn't be able to see it properly in pictures so what i'll do is i'll probably i'll pull in and see if i can give you a better sense of that. This is on my uh, pouch thing that I'm making. So there, yeah, you can see it there. You can see that you can see it along here. You see that? And then along here. So I've done that on two sides. So that really is the only purpose of this video, was just so that you could properly see that, because I wasn't convinced it would show up be uh, that well in photographs. So I'm not going to tell you how I did it, I'm sure you can figure out for yourself. Uh, this isn't a, a class or anything, but hopefully you get a good sense of that. And then in terms of what else has happened on here, there is pictures of this. In terms of what else is happening on here, I also added like a, just a tiny snippet of lace, but then I put a load of French knots around, two sides of it, and then the other curved area, I did some buttonhole lace, and that's kind of, you know, standing up like a little cup so I'm really pleased with that as well I'll pull in again I'm in and out in and out aren't I sorry about this right so that's like a little cup on there can you see that there I really like that and then I've added a row of bullion knots along here along the whole length of that and then over here try and get it in the line of the camera I've done a little bit of padded bumpy stuff with some of the lace, the machine made lace on t um, under it and then a couple of these threads go into the edge so that's how this is progressing but mainly it was this edge that I was really taken with and I really wanted to share with you so I hope I can get some really good pictures of that for the blog